Pero, uh, ¿tú sé que este área es de Belice? No es área de Belice, hay un, unos protocolos internacionales, hay que respetarlos. En esos protocolos se estableció que esta área no es para navegación de civiles. That exchange happened on Friday, September 14th, when the Belize Territorial Volunteers were on the Sarsun River scouting for a route for the Sarsun Island Eco Challenge that would be held the following day, Saturday. But during the trip, the BTV were encountered by the Guatemalan Armed Forces who asked the BTV to move out from the area. This encounter would set the stage for another incident that happened on Saturday, September 15th, during the Eco Challenge. Here's a part of that exchange. Hey guys, they are endangering our lives right here. Three Guatemalan going boat. We have a Coast Guard, clearly out man. These Guatemalans are violating our sovereignty. They are violating our human rights to move around freely in our country. The Guatemalans came over and tried their very best to stop our boat. When they saw that we were not going to let them stop our boat, they called for reinforcement. And so today the BTV and partners condemned what they call an act of aggression in the Sarstoon. They say that the Guatemalan armed forces repeatedly tried to stop them from going around the island. They are now calling on GOB to make a formal complaint about this incident. We joined the BTV in calling on our government to immediately send and notify Guatemala and the OAS of this incident, which violates the confidence building measures. But we further call on our government. This is an act of aggression by the military of Guatemala. And this is an incident that needs to go to the Security Council of the United Nations. And so we call on our government, please, and to compound matters, according to the BTV, there were two BDF vessels and a Coast Guard boat present, but that the BDF just looked on while they were aggressed. And while the Coast Guard attempted to assert its presence, in the end, the BTV were left on their own. But did this incident happen because the BTV failed to follow protocol when operating within the Sarstoon? According to a release from the Ministry of National Security, all Belizeans who go to Sarstoon are to make a request at the forward operating base for the BDF to escort them. It is a standard practice that, according to the ministry, the BTV failed to do on this round. And the reason why the BDF didn't intervene was to avoid armed conflict. But Mahia says that is simply not true. He claims they notified the BDF not once, but twice prior to Saturday's race. We did inform them the day before. It's, you're having a race, it's impossible to unrace while the race is going, to stop the race, to inform them that we're coming. Oh, we but the day before, we made a special trip down there and informed them that we will be having the race tomorrow. The Saturday before that, we informed the BDF and the Coast Guard in the village of Barranco that there will be the race the next Saturday, which would have been the 15th. So, completely false what he has put out, they were informed. Secondly, he can't say that they did not want to get involved because the situation was pressurized, because the Coast Guard did show some guts and came and was with us for a little while. So they did get involved. The Coast Guard was there. The Coast Guard, I think, just couldn't stand to see the Guatemalans harassing us. So the Coast Guard did come and try and show some support. Unfortunately, they were outgunned, outboat, and outmanned while two BDF boats sat at the dock. If those two BDF boats had come along with the Coast Guard, of course, the gaff would have had to back down. And so the BTV maintains that movement shouldn't be restricted in any part of Belize, including the Sarstoon. So today, they condemned the act. The freedom of movement in the country of Belize does not require any notification until and unless the government of Belize declares a statutory instrument which will declare an area as a special area and then they may restrict movement. There is no restriction of movement for Belizeans by the government of Belize in the Sarastoon up to today's date. Reporting for News 5, Amandra Polanco.